Hello friends, how are you guys doing? I hope you all guys will be definitely fit and fine. And I Yashoda welcome to all of you in my YouTube channel English with Dihati Madam. Friends, in today's video, I am going to tell you how can you handle the situation when people laughs at you, when people makes fun of you. How to deal with this problem? When I speak in English, in front of people, they make fun of me. They laugh at me. They laugh at my broken English. And it decreases my confidence level. Friends, this is a very big problem. It's a very big issue. And everyone who is on the journey of learning speaking English must have to go through this situation. They have to face this situation so many times. And I also have to face this situation because when I speak in English in front of people, they make fun of me. They laugh at me. They laugh at my broken English. I think too much about this problem. How to get control over this problem? And finally, I've got a solution for a for this situation. Now, the question is how to handle this kind of situation. Friends, I am making this video to tell you about how to handle this kind of situation and uh, keep focus on your learning and uh, English speaking. I have four points to handle this kind of situation. The first one is just be like a child. Friends, you must have heard the same that humans are figgy of mistakes. Anybody without making mistakes can't learn something. Because when we learn something, we make mistakes. We make too many mistakes. And this is the natural process of learning. Without making mistakes, we can't learn something. So, making mistakes, it's not a big deal. In our life, when we learn something like dance, piano, guitar, English speaking, we make too many mistakes and it's a natural process of learning. And if people laughs at you and you feel ashamed, your confidence level get down, then it's not a good thing. You have to deal with this problem. Only then you can learn. I want to give an example that just think about a child. When he think about a newborn child, when he learn, speaks, he mistake, he make so many mistakes. He fumble and stammer while speaking, and we make fun of him, we laugh at him, but the child doesn't care about it. He only wants to express his thoughts, but he won't. So. If you want to learn something, if you want to uh, handle this kind of situation, then you must have to be like a child and ignore this kind of person who laughs at you. Now, the second point. The second point is learn from your mistakes. Everyone makes mistakes so many times when he learns something like English if anyone makes laugh at you, at your mistakes, then you have to do only a small thing. Just change your thinking style. Change your mindset. Always think positive. Always learn something from your mistakes. If you make mistakes, then work hard to improve it. And if people laugh at you, let them laugh. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if they laugh at your mistakes, at your broken English. You have to do only a thing that you have to learn from your mistakes. Mistakes, mistakes are our friends. We have to learn from the mistakes. It doesn't matter that people laugh at you and your English. And now the third point is, the third point is to ignore the person who laughs at you. If someone laughs at your mistakes, 
if someone laugh at your broken english have you ever think does he have the right to laugh at you have you ever think how much english does he know have you ever have you ever think that uh, how much he able to speak in english he can speak a little bit of a little bit in he can speak a little bit in english or not obviously he can't he can't do it he can't do anything he only can laugh at others he only can point out the mistakes of other he can't do anything in his life the whole life he only point out the mistakes of the others person so you have to just ignore this kind of person you have to you don't pay attention this kind of person you just pay attention on your learning you just keep focus on your learning on your speaking okay friends he doesn't have the right to laugh at you he doesn't have the right to laugh at your broken english because when he laughs at you he reveals that what kind of person he is so stop thinking like this people who always point out the point out others mistakes and laugh at others just keep focus on your learning because you have to be perfect in english and just keep focus on your learning and keep hard work and the last point is you are the reason of someone's smile when people laughs at your mistakes when people laughs at you uh, your broken english your confidence level get down and you feel um, ashamed and you become sad just give me answer that uh, why you become sad rather you have to you should be happy that even you are able to make making people laugh because making people laugh is the most difficult thing in the in this world if you are the reason of someone's smile then it's a very big thing it's a great job you have done oh, friends i think it's a very big thing for you you have to feel proud on yourself you should feel proud on yourself at least you are able to make someone happy so friends take this situation in a positive way don't think about the negative way always think positive always learn something from your mistakes you want to quit or you want to learn something from your mistake if you want to quit then you have to do nothing just relax and if you want to be something in your life if your dreams big if you want to be a fluent english speaker then you must have to focus only on your learning just ignore all kind of this problems just keep focus only on your goals follow your dreams if people laughs at you take this situation in a positive manner don't take it in a negative way always think positive always be positive if you want to be a if you want to be something in life something in your life if you want to achieve something in your life if you have big dreams then you have to work hard to achieve your goals then you have to keep focus on your learning okay friends so ignore all the distraction that come in your ways only keep focus on your goal and i think you get my point that i want want to say that uh, how to deal with it, with this situation and friends if you like my video then please comment me and uh, if you like my video then please like share subscribe to my channel and uh, we will meet again in the next video till then bye bye